You know, GTA is one of those games I put so much time into to the point where, like, it got boring. I, I know some people, they never get bored of a game, but, like, holy shit. I've been playing this since, like, 2013. You know, I remember when I first got this bitch, you know, my mom, she didn't even let me get it at first. You know, I went to GameStop, and, you know, the employee there, he kind of screwed me over, you know. I was, like, so happy to get it. We were checking out, and he was, like... Ma'am, uh, you know that this game has sexual misconduct and violence. And my mom was like, oh, never mind. And we walked out. Bro, I was so mad. We know my dad hooked it up. Hey, and don't judge a book by its cover, bro. I know you guys are looking at my cars like, I'm fucking broke. Which, I mean, I am. If I'm gonna be honest. But, you know, that's one of my garages. I have a lot of garages. I'm gonna flex on y'all real quick. And there's a new update. Which, this one doesn't look boring. I know some of the updates they've made have been kind of lackluster but this car me one that actually kind of looks good we're doing a little little gta 5 um not car me what is it called a garage tour <laughs> but i used to love making these on my old channel i would like make all my cars look different every time but like yo my new garage i mean i i don't have oppressors i don't have those yachts and shit I, I never really, like, found those fun. I just buy what I think is cool, you know? I love this car right here. A lot of people slept on this car since... No, a lot of people are sleeping on this car because, you know, all these new cars that came out. But, like, back in the day when the game first came out, this was, like, considered rich shit right here, you know? In terms of GTA, you know, this was, like, the most expensive car. A lot of respect for that car. This is probably one of my favorites, though, right here. This was my second garage, actually. I'll show my last garage last, you know. My first garage ever is probably um, the most sacred one, if I'm going to be honest. Yo, I'm in a session by myself. What the hell? I feel like that's a blessing, low-key, because when you're in public lobbies, bruh, like, oh my god, I'll just be doing this, what I'm doing right now, and there will be someone that will just come up to you and just start fucking killing you. For no, oh my, oh my, oh my... Oh, they'll be you fucking stupid bitch, <laughs> bro. They'll be like people that just come up to you and start like killing you for no reason, and then they flex their KDs on GTA. I didn't know that shit was a thing until like the other day, or not the other day, but like earlier this year. I was like, what the? People actually be flexing their KDs on GTA. Like, I'm not even joking. Like, this guy killed me with that pressure, and then I killed him. And then this guy would not leave me alone the whole session. And he would text me on the phone. Like, on this GTA phone, you could actually text people. And he was texting me shit like, Oh, your KD is only a 1.80. Come on me on me. Like, bro, what? It's GTA. <laughs> Alright, this garage might be busting. I forgot what this one has, Loki. It might be busting. All right, now I remember this one. All right. I don't know why the... I called this one the Magneto. It looks like Magneto. I just like the orange on this one. I got this car for free. I bought a lowrider. You know, I'm really bad at saving money. That's another thing. Like, when I get a milli in this game, I just end up going crazy with it. Right now, I'm, I'm not buying anything because, like, I don't even know what the fuck to buy. Everything's, like, expensive as hell. I haven't even looked at any of the new stuff yet, but, like, I'll look at it in a minute, but I just, like, kind of already know that shit's gonna be mad expensive. Like, bro, GTA has inflation, bro. Like, there's politics to this game, bro. Like, saving up for a car in this game, it feels like an actual job. It's not fun. It's like, I feel like they kind of make some of the heists miserable on purpose and make, like, some of the AIs glitchy. So that, like, it's harder for you. Do you know what I mean? Like, I'll never forget the day I was playing Prison Break. And you know how you have to escort that old guy onto the plane? Bro, he was not spawning. Like, and we kept redoing it, and he would not spawn. Like, what is the excuse for that? Damn, dude. I had to go around. I actually really like this bike, too.
What the? Oh hell no! Nah. Sorry about your car. Sorry about your car. It was fun the first 800 times, but you know, doing missions and heists is not fun. You know, the double XP and double money events like that they do every week with new jobs, it's it's alright. But dude, sometimes some, some shit just gets repetitive, if you know what I mean. Like some of the adversaries are not fun after like the first three times. I remember one time it was like the Vespucci job one. And that one was fucking boring, dude. Oh, oh, oh! 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 Yo, like, I be forgetting that this is GTA. Like, I don't know, when I'm in the heat of the moment. No, I'm an ass driver, low key though. Oh, shit. Alright, bro. This garage is gonna surprise me too. You know, it's funny, because I haven't played this game like in a year. Around this time last year is also the reason why I kind of didn't upload, you know? I no-lifed the hell out of this game last year in the summertime. Damn, I hate this car. I don't care what anyone says. I just have it because I don't know what else to put in here. But, like, dude, the two fucking little fucking... What are those things called? <laughs> Exhaust? Bro, oh my, the car guy is going to go crazy for me not knowing what that shit is. You know, I'm not, I'm not that much of a car guy, but... These two little exhausting are fucking hideous. Oh, I love this car right here. This car is beautiful. I also love this car. I also like this one, bro. You know, this car right here is actually one of my favorite ones. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, yes, the jugular. I was so happy when I got the Audi. This is actually a really solid garage. Let's take the jugular out. Probably one of the best sounding cars in the game, in my opinion. To me, at least. This car is so nice. Like, if there's one car I could have in real life, bruh, from this game, it'd probably be this. I know that should probably break down, because... You know, when it comes to luxury cars, I feel like a lot of them aren't reliable. Like, yeah, they're fast and shit, but... Man, you have to have money to maintenance some of these cars. Jesus, dude, this car sounds so nasty. Bro, but no. As I was saying earlier, bro, GTA inflation exists. It does exist. Like, bro, a Millie used to get you a Bugatti, and a Millie doesn't even get you a fucking Honda Civic now, you know? And like they be charging a million to study shit to get missiles on a pressure like damn bro I'm only I'm already paying four mil Just give me that bullshit Who's in my session who the fuck is this that says he's my friend I don't remember who he is bro. I don't know I had a really bad habit of just adding people when I played with them and I used to play Fortnite like, I remember, like, in my Fortnite days, I would do click. And I just had a bad habit, dude, of just adding everyone that I ever did good with. Like, if I went in a game and we all got, like, 10 kills and shit with, like, randoms, I would just add them. And it led to me having way too many fucking people on my friends list. Yo, oh, I know this guy, too. You know, the, these people joining my session is making me anxious. Let's see what this garage has. I have an idea. This is my last one. What happened to my car? What? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my. Bro, they need to fix that. They need to fix that. I hate that. Oh my. Ugh, I just farted. I love GTA, but like, after seven years, bro, th th something needs to be added to this game, bro. They need to spice something up. Dude, I remember when I first got this car, I was so relieved. Like, I wanted this car for so long. 
it's only like 2.5 mil, but like I told y'all earlier, bro, I'm not really good at fucking keeping money, bro. Uh, I, I kind of spend instantly. Yeah, dude, this is definitely my favorite garage. How can we help you? Oh, it comes back because it was blown up by someone. Damn, dude. Wow. I, I forgot I had this garage. Now, this in the old GTA, you know, back in the day was probably my favorite car. Like, this is probably one of the earlier cars that they brought to the game that I actually fell in love with. Dude, this was the most popular car back in the day, dude. Like, and for a good reason. Like, just look at the back of it. Like, the bumper and everything so nice about it. And I know a lot of people don't like spoilers, but holy shit. Like, I look like fucking Batman in this car. Okay, I'm getting carried away. I'm being corny as fuck. This reminds me of the T20, but it's cheaper, so I just bought it. I did have a T20, but I forgot what I did with it. It didn't have as much customization, I think, so I just kind of got rid of it. Turismo, another classic, bro, that I love. I love this car. A lot of respect for it. Alright, what's in, what's new? Okay, so, let's look at the cars. Uh, I wonder if it's going to be in... Is it going to be in this one? Los Santos Tuner, sorry, that's one of the new ones. Yo, a milli for that piece of shit car? Bro, like, it's nice, but like, like, come on, bro. They need to be more realistic. Like, this shit looks like you'll be on the street. Damn, dude, these are all part of the tuners. What the hell? Bro, what the fuck is this? Alright, so these are the six cars from the tuners. Dude, oh my. Like, they're cool. I thought this was already in the game. See, the problem is some of these cars look like they were already in the game. Like, Anis Ramas. I don't even know how to say that shit. Is there something in Legendary Motorsport? I really hope there's. Oh. Damn, dude. There ain't no way, bruh. Yo. Oh, my. That car is nice. I'm not gonna lie. That's a 350Z, I think. <laughs> or a 370. I don't know. I, I don't know a lot about cars, but it's funny because when it comes to cars in GTA, I was actually kind of into it. I don't know. Maybe it's because you can actually, like, earn the cars in this game. Real life, that shit harder, bro. Like, I ain't gonna go running around in real life to earn a car, bro. But in GTA, I have unlimited stamina. Yo, what the fuck? What am I talking about? Alright, I actually kind of do want the other car. I know I'm probably gonna fucking end up... Bro, that's so deceiving. What the fuck? Yo... It says a milli to like a milli 300, but like make like it makes it seem like you're buying a lower end of something, bro. What? That's the trading price. Fuck these people, bro. I'll earn it though. I'll get it eventually. Damn, dude. Inflation in GTA is no joke, bro. These people be trying your ass. No joke though, they actually do be trying you. Close the door. Alright. I ain't gonna lie, I wanna take this car out low key. I heard there's new haircuts. Haircut. Uh, I nah, bro. GTA. This update. It's, it's cool. I know you can do car meets now without being killed. Oh my god. Let's see this bullshit. 
Hello. Oh, this guy got a fire haircut. You already know he got. What the fuck? My character looks weird. I don't remember him being like this. Wait, there's a new haircut. I heard there's a new haircut. Yo, don't tell me those are the only ones they added. Yo, bro, like, what the fuck? They couldn't make the characters, like, have a fade or something, bro? Who the fuck has the hair like this in real life? Please tell me. Some of these are understandable, but holy shit. Nah, bro, they be trying it with some of these haircuts. Alright, this one's actually kind of decent. It's better than... I feel like having a buzz cut makes you look a little edgy. I know it's not exactly a buzz cut, but... Bro, like, who the fuck has their hair like that? Like, everyone gets fades, bro. Like, come on, bro. These people have made gang uh, games about gangsters and the culture of America, but, like... No one does their hair like that. No one just gets a one all across the edges. Or the sides, whatever you want to call it. Oh shit, you can add hair to your character? What the? Oh hell not, Shazam. Yeah, what? That is crazy. I didn't know that. So you tell me these people can add hair to my character, but they can't make them have a certain bullshit. Alright, that's alright. Alright, this update was cool. The car meet things looks cool. Um. I'll give it like an 8 out of 10. This is really good compared to some of the other ones they've made. Bye guys.